Japan's new defense minister has declined to say whether Japan liberated or invaded Asian countries before the Second World War, or if Japanese troops massacred civilians in China. On Thursday, Tomomi Inada held her first group interview and was asked to clarify her views on wartime history. Whether you would describe Japan's action as an invasion is not factual, but it depends on one's point of view. Each individual has their own perception. As for me, I believe that it's important for historical views to be based on objective facts. I don't think it is appropriate for me to personal comment on this. The new defense minister of Japan is known for her revisionist views of the country's wartime actions. She has called for a revamp of Japan's war-renouncing constitution to ease the constraints on the military operating overseas. Inada has also been a regular visitor to Tokyo's Yasukuni Shrine for War Dead. Neighbors, including China and South Korea, see the shrine as a symbol of Japan's past militarism. Inada was asked if she would visit it again ahead of the August 15th anniversary of Japan's surrender in 1945. She declined to comment. Latest data by the Kyoto News Agency shows that only a third of those interviewed showed support for her nomination.